Several trucks have gotten stuck under the Northgate Mile underpass in the past few months, most recently this week. So the question is, why does this keep happening? And are there plans to do something about this? Local News 8's Noah Farley has the answers. It's become a too familiar sight. You may remember when a semi-truck hauling another semi-truck overturned in the Northgate Mile underpass back in March, or when a log truck got stuck in the same place on Wednesday. Why does this keep happening? Well, the structure was built for the railroad in the 1930s, so it was not built to today's height standards. It's seen continual improvements in the time since then, some of them more substantial than others. It's had continual monitoring, of course. Fortunately, Buffett says there are plans to help the underpass situation. We are working with the city of Idaho Falls on an advanced warning system that would be able to detect truck height well before it hit that area of roadway. And then signs would start to blink, letting them know there's a height requirement, a particularly different height requirement than usual. Idaho Falls is planning for the warning system and is getting ready to bid, while ITD is funding the project. After getting specialized equipment, installation and construction would start summer 2025 at the earliest. In the meantime, Buffett recommends truck drivers take alternate routes to avoid the underpass. It might take extra time, but it will still be less time than getting stuck under the bridge. In Idaho Falls, Noah Farley, Local News 8.